keep on rolling. The undefeated Golden Eagles focuses on their next opponent, UCLA. Don't let the record fool you. These guys are killers, mate. Okay, fellas, welcome back to the Alaska series. Let's get right on into it. You can see that Kirk has been an OG, but they have a B plus overall with an A minus offense and a B plus defense. Their defense is as good as ours. We, of course, destroy them in every facet of the game, but they're still good. And we have to play in California as well. They lost to USC, who we destroyed. The Old Dominion must be good now. Every team we've looked at, well, they're not. It's just weird that every team that we go up against, it seems that, you know. Anyway, UCLA did beat Stanford, which is pretty cool. We have to verse them in the conference championship, I'm assuming. Meanwhile, we've just been killing it. The last two games have been a little bit sloppy. We can't go easy against UCLA. The next three games after that seem to be pretty easy. The quarterback's doing pretty good, 1,500 yards. That's, you know, respectable, I guess. SEC fight, Florida notches a conference win behind the arm of Suggs. Speaking of the top 25... Penn State beat Minnesota again. They now take on Illinois. It's going to be Penn State and Alaska. You can just tell at this rate. Florida did pick up a slim dub against Georgia. LSU beat SMU 52-0 and SMU is ranked 15. Very, very odd things going on seven years in the future. Gilliam is now leading for the Heisman after that massive 200-yard performance last episode. He also picked up four touchdowns. I'm not really feeding the guy. He's just making big plays against easier competition. Jim Gilliam and Robert Rolls, the free safety from Tulane. That being said, fellas, four games left to go. We can't lose now, otherwise it's going to be too far gone. Also remember that I am recording these all in bulk before I go to the States. So if you've been commenting on the last couple of videos, asking for this and that and that, I haven't seen your comment. Anyway, fellas, let's get into it. They've got a lot of really solid people visiting this week. And they've got a 97 overall, a 96, and a 93. Granted, two of them are kicker and punter. But still, they're good players. Man, I... Chris Davis sucks at man. If Harrison is on a blitz, I'm going to make it my mission to man up with Chris Davis. Oh, they go screenplay. Fantastic. We missed the tackle. Boost. I can't stand hurry up teams, they're frustrating. Screenplay again. Get stuck on the block, come on Harrison, make the play. Let's go baby. Oh, run play, get on the ground. Here we go again, Harrison one on one with Smith on the outside, running back is tired. I don't, what's going on here? Where's he gonna go? He's gonna throw it out of bounds. Smart play by the UCLA quarterback. All right, we got to get wiggly with the sticks here. We do have the squiggly line cheese. Ironically, we don't have it against the easier teams, but the teams with the bigger fan bases. Ah. Oh, we had square for a second. Run up square. I'm taking triangle. Gilliam. Oh, why did he? Okay, I appreciate that. I wish I could flip this, but it's all good. I don't trust our freshman wide receivers to block. Juke move. Oh, I triple juke. Let's go. Easiest touchdown of my life, mate. Get back, cheese. Oh, that's illegal, ref. I don't know if I want to run the man here and take the risk. Let's put Wallace on a little quarterback spy here just in case. He's going to throw it out again. All right, this is super risky right here. If we do not make the right read, this is going to be a safety. They're playing the safeties back and everything. It's like not even a blitz. Duke move. Slide. No, don't take a hit. Get the blocks, boys. Okay, Scorigami potentially 7-5. to five. This looks like a screenplay. They don't really run the ball all that much. They do pass it a lot. Ah, the... Oh, this... Chris Davis! He's gonna pick six it after all of the mistakes! Let's go, baby! That kind of makes up for all of the weeks of getting burnt on man coverage. The quarterback never runs the ball. Clearly doesn't have the best decision making. This is perfect for us. This is like a dream come true right over my head. Damn it. Run play. Oh, I can't get off the block. Come on. There we go. Screenplay? Question mark? Give me that. Let's go. Clifford Jean. He's a beast. He is also now tied for the most interceptions in the NCAA. These guys are good, but their quarterback is making a lot of Perum Crow reads right now. And that's uh, really costing their chances of winning. 
Right across the middle. Nate Foster. Who else? Oh, crap. Blitz is coming. Throw it out. Ooh, hoo, hoo. This is what happens when I try and stay under center. It does not work for me, mate. I accidentally put on aggressive on the clock as well. So, we might be running hurry up here. <laughs> the defense is putting in mad work. But I can tell UCLA definitely isn't out of it yet. They've got so much potential. Oh, there we go. Duke move. No. All right, nice first down. On the plus side here, we kick to them to start the game. So if we can get a cheeky field goal here, start out the second half with the ball. Mate, we'll be in a fantastic spot. Mmm, the freshman can't come down with it. That's man coverage. Step back cheese. Oh, hoo, hoo. Mario Hill. Step back cheese again. Okay, that was a little bit too much cheese. Oh, they ain't ready for this. They are not ready for this. Crap, I'm not ready for this. We get sacked. We're not in field goal range. Oh, it's man coverage, though. I need some time in the pocket. I let it go. That is, that is gorgeous. Oh, what's this? Huh? That's, that's picked off. That's what it is. That was a bad throw. I thought he was in zone. Burks. Burks gets blocked. No. No, 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 Landry. <laughs> We've struggled a lot today. Alaska only up 14 to 12. On the plus side, we do get the ball to start out. Shouts out to the Alaska fans. The best fans in the world. Got him. Got him. Out of bounds. See, even if we can get a touchdown, we make this a two-possession game. Field goal, not so much. Take that all day. Let's go, Pierre. Breaks a tackle. They've got so many. This guy's got to stand up. He can't even take a seat. Oh, nice. Look at the block. That's a... That's nearly a touchdown. Oh, that's Jake Jones. Okay. I think I asked this last episode, but let me know. If you could buy an Alaska player's jersey, who would it be or why? For me, overall, it's got to be Harrison, but Jake Jones, close in second. And then Corey Webb on the D-line, the freshman in third. I know somebody out there wants a Clifford Jean jersey. What's wrong with you? This is man coverage. I feel like this is low-key man. It is man coverage. Rip. There goes Xavier Simon. He's not going to drop that. We got this, man. Man coverage all the way. Chris Davis got a pick. We sitting pretty right now. Okay. Now I'm on the running back again. Rip. Oh! All right, bro. Running back's tied. If they call a screen, it's a GG. I'm picking that off. We haven't had a pick with Harrison a couple episodes either. Run play. Ran through the wrong gap, of course. Come on. They're not ready for this. They're not ready. I told you. No first down allowed. The only scary thing is they have made this a six-point game, though. We can knock down a field goal back in front by a good margin. Come on. Oh, there we go. Breaking tackles. About time. Of course, this is going to be holding on the offense. Oh, it's clipping. Ah, that's a, uh, unfortunate. We lose this game, you can kiss the natty goodbye. I do not like this formation at all. Can I switch? This is a much better, but it'll have to do. Crap. Oh, that is Jones the freshman. Let's get R1 streaking up. It's man coverage. I'm taking off. I'm gone. Oh, the spin. Oh, we are so close. We can have that. All right, we're jumping in zone coverage. This is getting too scary. Gonna play it safe. I'll even jump on the flat with Gene just in case. Because we know they're not gonna go the flat. Let's be honest. Run play. Oh, there we go. Gonna call the good old cover three. Gotta trust the D-line. Gonna send four. We're not gonna press because we know they're not gonna run it. Oh, I'm on that. No, I'm not. No! Another run play. All of a sudden, they're a running team. GG, the running back's tired. I doubt they're going to go to him. They are going to go to him. Oh, the D's there to wrap him up. He's gonna, they're going to run it. And he's going to score. Oh, you cannot make this up, though. I don't think it's necessary to pass it just yet. The yards are identical. We can get away with running it for a bit. Then we might have to catch them off guard. Oh, look at this. Straight out the gate. 
Jim Gilliam, he's gonna carry the team. Let's go, baby. 30 yards on the first play. Let's go back to it. Let this stretch out. We sitting pretty. Jake Jones gonna break a tackle. Ah, oh, ah, oh, easy first down. You 100% know they're about to ice the kick up. But if we can score a touchdown, we'd be in a much better spot. Look at this. We got blockers. Jim Gilliam doesn't care about ice the kicker. The Heisman leader gonna take it in. I simulated the kickoff and we've got the ball. I'm not making this up, mate. They fumbled it off the kickoff or something. Well, I guess, I guess that's GG then. 66 yard kick, recovered by Alaska. We got the ball back, the game's over, mate. Fourth down, they've got no more timeouts. That's it, that's the game right there. Woo! Checking out the stats on the day, Darren Duncan with a 151.6 passer rating, 53% completion rate. Bit sloppy, mate, but we had the pressure coming. We struggled, but he's all good. Rushing into things, Jimmo again, just carrying the team. Darren Duncan, nice 52. And Jake Jones. Jake Jones, gotta love him. On the receiving end, pretty evenly distributed in terms of receptions. Not really much going on, though. Xavier Simon, the freshman, with a big touchdown. He's been killing it lately. And on the defensive end, Kurt Hayes tying Anthony Harrison for the most tackles in the game. Game. Clifford Jean got an interception. So did Chris Davis with that pick six. We're lucky we got those turnovers too. Otherwise, I don't think we would have cruised so easily to the end of that game. Really solid effort by the defense nonetheless. Three more games left, boys. That being said, fellas, if you made it this far into the video, you are the real MVP. I hope the rest of your day is awesome. And from me personally, I'm out. Peace. <laughs>